Milton Keynes is a great uh, city for technical businesses. I think its location is incredibly important. There's plenty of technical businesses already in the city. But just up the road, we've got technical hubs such as the Silverstone Cluster. And of course, we're close by to major cities with a big technical community in them, such as Oxford and Cambridge. And this is important because there's an influx of people into this area and they've already got an interest in technology. They've got some great skills and experience. So we've got a workforce ready to go. Secondly, uh, the, the support services and institutions, they really understand technology businesses, whether we're talking about governmental or financial um, or educational for that matter. Secondly, it's a young city, and it's young in, in terms of the age of the city. Most of what you see in Milton Keynes is there by design, and it's designed to grow. So as the city is growing, you can see from the infrastructure that it's, it's evolving in a way that meets the needs of the technical community and technical businesses. But there's also a young population as well. So we've got a a population of people who've already got an affinity with technology. They, they've got an appetite for innovation and, and they expect their employers to, uh, to embrace technology, to be the sort of places where a young population would, would wish to work. And then lastly, I think there's an ethos here and the ethos is in two forms. Firstly, the, the ethos is about bringing businesses into the city and supporting them the best way possible. Um, and secondly, there's an ethos around skills and education. And the colleges and universities we've got within the city and around the city, they are working incredibly hard to, 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 to meet and work with employers to really understand their needs and to develop curricula that absolutely match those needs. Um, as for BizTech, well, BizTech is a membership organisation and we're building a strong membership with a not just from within the technical technical community but uh, with a very wide range of disciplines and we also have contacts as well really strong contacts across the city and more widely across the region and our purpose is to help our members to to grow to flourish to build their businesses and uh, and the way we do this is in in four ways firstly education and skills sharing. We've been pioneering the development of, of skills-based workshops in the area of digital technology and data, um, and we're continuing to develop them, working in partnership with our members to get them absolutely right, exact, exactly matching their needs. Secondly, it's through uh, financial support, but this takes the form of connecting our members in with people who can provide the, 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 the right form of financial support they need, whether this be economic packages that are available through the council, um, and we've currently got programmes underway at the moment which are specifically aimed towards technical innovation associated with environmental sustainability, but also through the financial institutions such as banks, economic packages available through the growth hubs, and lastly through organisations such as angel investors. Thirdly, we uh, help our members to develop the digital infrastructure that they have in their business. And we have diagnostic packages which allow our members to pinpoint where digital technology could provide a booster to the way their organisation works. And we then point them towards the people who can best help them put that digital infrastructure into place, ideally from within our members, but uh, perhaps more from uh, more widely than that. And then lastly, there's mentoring support. We've got a wide group of technical leaders, people with good, strong business leadership experience who are willing and able to provide mentoring support for any members who need it. So that's Milton Keynes and that's BizTech. Thank you very much.